amazing ability to put everything in one place and really improve the quality of what we do and the um, volume of what we do. Ha having all our scientists in one location and a much bigger location has allowed us to do a lot more of the very basic work that's really critical in launching a test and a product in a range of different areas. So we've more than doubled our scientific team. We have all five robots in the same lab and we have a, a much more expansion space so we can continue to add to the team here. Being in the mirror means a great deal for us uh, in terms of talent because we are surrounded by universities and therefore we're able to bring talent over to our, uh, to our company and expand the team quite rapidly. So we're uh, around 24 people now, plan to be 30 people at the end of uh, this year. But also we're getting help from Namur Invest, the Sofinex, the Walloon region and AWEX, which is the, uh, the Walloon Export Agency. When I joined Volition in 2011, we were only two and we just start from, from scratch basically. We, have, we share a bench in a, in a lab at the university and it's just amazing to see that six years after we have our own building. We have a lab, uh, 2,200 meters square. We have also a room dedicated to our automated uh, system with an automated platform to run our clinical studies. And we have also a room dedicated to uh, all the freezer to be able to store all our clinical samples, which is a very important uh, for us. With the increased capacity in this facility, getting samples, cohorts from Asia, it's so important for the test that we have. So we're now getting ethnic mix in Asia. Um, having an increased capacity allows us to run the test, allows us to validate our test. Um, that in itself provides a lot of confidence for the markets in Asia. For our collaborators, for example, visiting the lab really, I think, gives them a different view about what we're doing. It gives them a real sense of what great science we are doing. Our primary focus has always been in colorectal cancer and that's continuing. In the meantime, over the past year, we've got a hugely expanded facility here in Belgium. So we're now expanding out into some of the other cancers. In particular, we're looking at 27 different cancers to find you know, what, what, in what sort of cancers does our technology um, help best and what assays uh, look best in, in different cancers. Um, but the platform's even bigger than cancer, so we're also looking at, at some studies in, in non-cancer areas as well. Oh, we feel very good about the Belgian region here in Namur and the Walloon region. Um, obviously I'm not uh, French-Belgian, uh, but we come here a lot and we've really set down our roots here because we've had some fantastic team members, there's a great uh, array of talent here, and the facility has been fantastic, and the help from a few different institutes in the region has been absolutely fantastic. They've supported us in everything we do and continue to supply us with non-dilutive funding. So it's just a much cheaper place to do it than in Cambridge in England or in the US, for example. And we've been extremely happy here and we'd certainly recommend it to anyone else thinking of coming to Belgium.